What's up guys, this is Roma again. Um, today I want to go over something today in logic that's called auto punching. Auto punching is used um, in making take folders or in simply recording over a region at a specific place that you command it to. So for example, say um, right here in my, in my song, say these, this, this right here is my intro riff. And say your intro if was um pretty hard for you to play, so say around right here and my intro if it's it's a difficult part for me to play and I keep on getting it wrong over and over again. Well what I can do is another solution to getting your recordings as you want perfectly in logic is to auto punch. And the way we were gonna auto punch is turn auto punch right here on your transport bar turn it on now up here your auto punch comes in like this and you can resize your auto punch as much as you want as large as you want as small as you want but the main idea of auto punch is to put it in a specific place where you want your recording to be done so we're going to see what auto punch can do. When auto punch is enabled and I push record, it'll only start recording after this first mark right here. So anything inside this auto punch is what is going to be recorded and the rest won't. So that is a brief explanation on auto punch. Uh, stay tuned for I'm punching out on the fly. I'll make this video right after I finish this one. So, actually, this one's just finished. So, have a good day. Auto punch, guys.